as of the time of this video's release. We have been facing a concerning increase of missing persons and fatalities on a global scale. The reason for this is because we are under attack. We have discovered that there has been a significant growth of mimic populations, which is threatening public safety. National leaders have released this instructional recording to teach you on how to defend yourself. Here is what you need to know about the threat. Mimics are humanoid, intelligent predators that are highly adaptive and feed solely on human prey. Mimics gain information on people by watching their daily lives and pick to hunt people when they are most vulnerable. The most common times a mimic will attack is when you are asleep, that walking alone, or in a cornered position. Mimics are cautious and calculative creatures, taking precautions to ensure a successful hunt. They utilize various tactics to capture a person by surprise. One of the more well-known tactics is hiding itself inside of furniture, to blend into its environment. Common objects that mimics can hide inside are sofas, recliners, wardrobes, ottomans, and other places a mimic can comfortably wait. Mimics are able to contort their body in ways that allow them to fit inside smaller places. They also use it to expand their body, making themselves appear larger for intimidation. Another method mimics use to blend in is their ability to put on and wear clothing. Mimics put on layers of shirts, pants, and jackets to hide their bright red skin and blend into densely populated areas. In very rare cases, mimics can develop and grow to look very similar to human beings. Pairing this with clothing, it can be very hard to tell the difference between a mimic and a person right away. If you are unsure if a person is a mimic, look out for key features that may reveal their true form. Look for abnormal facial features, like large, bulbous eyes, flat noses, wide mouths in an uncanny smile, and clammy skin. Also pay attention to other exposed body parts like hands. Mimic people will have long fingers with no fingernails. If you are unable to see their face or hands, watch their walking pattern. Mimic's legs are long and hunched. Their walking will be unusual and irregular. Here is what you do if you are met with a mimic. If it stands before you, do not panic. Stand your ground and try to appear larger. Wave your hands and make plenty of noise. Maintain eye contact. A mimic will hesitate to attack a potential threat. If you are armed with a weapon, aim for the head or legs. These are the best areas to hit to immobilize the threat. Fight back and don't let it get a hold on you. If you find a mimic that hasn't discovered you yet, stay out of sight. Call the authorities and alert them of your location. Stay where you are to avoid startling the mimic. If the mimic gives chase, run. Try to get somewhere out of sight and hide. Do not leave the area. Officials will need to locate you to help. Stay low and stay quiet. With the information you have learned, use it well, and stay safe. Got it. Let's see. Yep, it's working. Okay, can we get a move on? Uh, one sec. Yeah. Uh, okay. Hello. I thought you only had 30 minutes of tape on that. I know, but I just gotta see how it works. Like, yeah, well, I never got to use one of these. Night. <laughs> yeah, too bad. You were the only person who could film with me, so you're going to have to put up with it. Fine. Yeah.
Yeah. Screw you. Screw you. Screw you. It's still way too dark. One sec. There we go. Hello. light now. But look at that over there. You can't see anything unless I like point directly over there. Like, nope, can't see nothing. Are you sure we should be out this late? Fine. I'll cook you stuff when we get home. Don't worry. I'm hungry. Too bad. but it still turns off and on randomly for some reason. Like, it's the best thing I could get my hands on, though. Turning on and off, but it's the only thing that they would give me. It works, so I just gotta watch. This is gnarly. It's not my fault this guy lives in a fucking dump. We're almost there. We just gotta get through the woods. Do you see it, though? Uh, hopefully I show up on camera as well. Uh, hopefully there are lights out there. Like, people still live there, right? Oh, Can't be that bad. Pretty dark to me. But, it was just one guy. I I don't know why. Like, why would they get rid of everything? Dogs barking are never a good sign. No. The sky looks nice. This thing can't capture it. Can barely capture the ground in front of me. So, what are we doing out here exactly? Well, supposedly they found some guy. Like, it was like. It was like a grody scene. Like it was disgusting. Like they, like they had to get rid of the trailer he was in, and then, like they didn't let anyone nearby, and it was like this big conspiracy. So yeah, I'm filming that. Hopefully, I get a good mark for it. There we go. We're getting close. Yeah, we're almost there. We're on the road. We're right next to it. Like, it's literally up there. Okay. Come on. It's not too late yet. I'm hungry. You said that already. Yeah. I'm still hungry. 
soon, okay? Almost there. It'll be, it'll, it'll be like five minutes. Five minutes, okay? We're on the road. We're almost there. We just got past the tree line and make the way to the trailer park. Then we can go home, okay? Okay. I don't want to be out here either. It's a weird place. See, we're right here. You go ahead. I can't. You can't see a thing. Where am I even going? Uh, just up here. There should be a path. Right there. Yeah, right here. Okay. See, I found the path. We're all good. This way. I think this way. Yo, look at this. I didn't see this on my way over here last time. It's cool. Like we could, we could get a shot of this in like atmosphere, you know? It's it just looks like tetanus to me. Uh, hopefully. Sh One sec. Let me get a good lighting on that. There we go. Yeah, look at that. That's cool. Hey, look, there's like old stuff here as well. Anyways. We're on the flat part now. Yeah, we're close. The trailer should be right up ahead. This is where everyone was. There's no one here now, though. Not a single building in sight. Except like way over there, but there's no one here. It's the strangest thing. This is the spot right here. Yeah, this thing. Okay, so you you take the camera and the light. Uh, pointing at me, but don't point in my eyes, please. Um, make sure. Can I look? Like a barf bag. Thanks. Okay, 
You said grizzly way too much. What? <laughs> you said grizzly way too much. Too much? Yeah. Okay, should I retry? Uh, sure. Okay. Uh, pause. That one turned out alright, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, why is it rolling? Did you catch that? Oh, 30 minutes to film and yet you screwed up. I needed someone to film. No hard feelings, okay? Okay. I know, it's pretty scary out here, I know. I understand. Yeah, because, like, back there was the perfect time for a serial killer to just jump out and grab us, you know? Cut it out! It's scary enough as is. Chris? Ah! <laughs> 